Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. I'm going to be showing y'all how I make 20 gold an hour on my hunter. This is the highest gold farm that I have found on my hunter. I have been trying and trying and trying to find a gold farm on my hunter because I don't want to sit there and boost RFC all day. Um, I enjoy playing the hunter. This farm is very reminiscent of Dire Mall East and Dire Mall North. We're going to be at the Circle of West Binding here, close to the wall. And we will be running Marksmanship Build with Efficiency, Improved Hunter's Mark, Lethal Shots, one point into Hawkeye. You could put this one point into Concussive, but the Concussive proc is so low. Even I had 5 out of 5 Concussive, and I still barely ever proc'd it with these guys. But we'll be running Lone Wolf, Chimera, and then the leg slot doesn't matter at all. Um, I did test out Lone Wolf and Heart of the Lion side by side. Lone Wolf does pull ahead in this one situation, otherwise never use Lone Wolf in PvP or PvE situations. Only for this, use Lone Wolf. We tested it on a live stream with raiding and PvP, and Lone Wolf is garbage. So let's just jump right into it. I am the only hunter to do this this way, so I wanted to share with you guys the knowledge that I've learned. Like I said, we learned this on my live stream. Check me out on Twitch. That's where I get down and cozy for hours and hours and hours and do stuff like this. YouTube is more concentrated live streams. Um, yeah, let's get into it. We're gonna auto shot after we hunters mark. I do recommend getting a weapon swing timer and pulling these mobs. Now you don't have to concussive shot on cooldown. But we are going to make sure to have Cheetah up as we pull him to this little ledge right here. He's going to be forced to run up the ledge as we drop down. Which gives us more time to auto attack and Chimera. Now the next spot we go to, I do recommend not auto attacking and keeping a substantial distance in between you and the mob for this spot. And we are actually going to concussive shot him as we approach this mountain. It is a little hard to get up this mountain. And then we jump the ledge. Now, if you're up on this ledge too long, like you saw, he actually does heal to full, which is fine. He is going to run over there. As he runs over there, we drop back down into a concussive shot. Sometimes if you get caught on that ledge, the mob might actually run back and just totally evade you, but that's okay. I factor that into the gold per hour, and it is still 20 gold even when you lose mobs. So we're just going to run back to our spot here, drop down, and I have never died doing this far. Not even once. Now you don't arcane shot because arcane shot does I think 9 damage to these guys. Uh, but we're just going to go ahead and repeat everything. Like I said, it's deathless. If I had a fear of dying, I would um, concuss him, but uh, we're just going to drop and kill. And as you saw, you just juggle between this ledge here and this ledge here. The mountain is going to be your hardest uh, part. Getting up this mountain it can be a little tricky sometimes. Once you get it, once you get the rhythm down, you'll get the uh, get the feel for it. As you saw, we just got one burning charm. Uh, I did get eight burning charms and one elemental fire for the hour that I spent here gold farming. And as you saw, that pull maybe took a minute, and we got one burning charm. Uh, I know that does factor to more than 20 gold an hour, but I like to have a set average for everybody because sometimes your RNG is going to be a little less, sometimes your RNG is going to be a little more. So thank you guys for tuning in. I hope this helped you enjoy playing your hunter like it has helped me. This is what I'll be doing for the rest of this phase because I actually enjoy doing this kind of stuff as a hunter, as a person who ran dire mall east a billion times so thank you everybody for tuning in follow me on twitch thank you for watching this video like subscribe i go live on youtube too 
if you want to get a cozy live stream we do longer live streams on twitch youtube's more concentrated live streams thank you so much and i will see you in the next one for the next live bye bye